Welcome back ladies and gentlemen to the Olympus Sky. I'm super excited to bring you this image here because it's loaded with, with machinery, artificial shapes, whatever you like to call it. And um, again, this week, uh, like last week, we will be checking out two images in two parts. So when you're done watching this video, I will be recording and uploading part two. It will be uh, online within the hour when you have watched this. Now, uh, I don't know how long this video will take, but uh, I am pretty excited to uh, see some interesting curiosity images. And, um, you know, one thing that I would like to do, at least in 2015, one of my goals is to upload more regularly. And <clears throat> since I'm very, very familiar with Curiosity, it's uh, it's basically a breeze for me. But, um, yeah, I think um, they all did. It's, it's not as good as it used to be. Um, it's it's not as many interesting pictures anymore. They don't, you know, it's it's like pictures of the floor and such, which is, isn't that interesting. But uh, anyways, let's jump into this because this is really crazy. Now, uh, remember, in all pictures, you can find them on my Google Plus and uh, whatever you like to call it. So uh, here you see. And I posted like another picture here while I was searching for some interesting anomalies here. Now, what, uh, where are we here? Now, when you're on my page here, click here and follow me on Google Plus. Definitely do so. Um, I, you can contact me there. I mean, um, whatever you like to do there, you can send me an image, whatever. Or you can mail it to me, which is fine as well. But this image, you know, it's it's pretty crazy. And like last week, um, let me just show you quickly before we jump in. Uh, now keep this as an eye marker, this little road here. And here again. So these images are next to each other. But let's start with the really crazy stuff here. <clears throat> and in part two, I actually found uh, something I haven't found for a very long time. So for something that looks a bit like a skull or something. Now uh, let's jump into this because I'm really excited to show you this. Now let me make this a bit smaller in my old school mode. And um, so you have more viewing and uh, more, more viewing area here. Be sure to always watch my videos in full screen. And I can't compensate with zoom in, zoom out for everyone, unfortunately. Um, the first thing that I really noticed here, it it's kind of looks uh, quite funny. Um, it, it kind of reminds me of a face, of course. It's, it's not a face, I know. But uh, and then imagine this, the nose and the mouth here. So it's quite funny. Um, it, it is very interesting because at first I thought, you know what, let's grab a look here. Could this be like, um, like flat, laying flat on the ground? But on closer inspection, when we check this out, you can see that there's like a um, cable curve here coming out. So this is higher up and you can see here it's it's going up. Um, definitely it's it, this piece is high up here. Um, <coughs> excuse me. I know um, that it's 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 kind of weird. I can't make anything out here, but it's it is a very interesting shape. At least I so just noticed this as well. Um, I haven't seen this before. Always got to point out those uh, weird 90 degree angles and everything. Um, we are seeing them too often on Mars and um, the reason well either civilization or it's like you can find it everywhere <laughs> but, uh, I haven't seen that it's not like I go to the beach and I see 90 degree angles everywhere again here a interesting 90 degree angle and um, it looks a bit like I really don't know we can see how how the debris is is laying around here in a rectangular way and you can see all those weird intricate details here i'm pretty excited about this because it looks it doesn't look to be natural that's definitely true and it's laying next to this thing could this thing actually be lying on top of this thing in the past it does seem to um you know when you look at the size and everything and the shapes it, it could actually potentially be sitting on this in the past i um, also found this weird like uh, spider like type thing here and I have no idea what it is, could be just, you know, junk, but uh, it is interesting, that's for sure. Uh, there are also a couple of boxes here, and it's it's crazy. I mean, um, here we have, like, a plate uh, sitting around in a curve, and then uh, going like this. Looks artificial as well. So, really interesting, that's, that's for sure. But I had a couple of more things here to show you. Um, this really looks like a hexagonic shape, like... Um, you see it's really weird and uh, d definitely like when you zoom out you can see like it's it's kind of hexagonic and uh, it looks a bit weird but I got other anomalies to show you here 
um, that are a lot clearer. Now, let me find it for you. I will start with, I think that was on the other image. Uh, let me check out. Uh, let me know in the comment section what you think of this because we could do this weekly we could do two images two videos every weekend um like i said it's it's a lot less time consuming than those um what i call the master videos like iabetes and um phobos and such it takes a lot of time because i do not work with one image i try my best to reconfirm it with different images and such <coughs> um let me move out here i mean it, it's to me it really looks like some kind of machinery and definitely when you go to this part you will find it even more interesting as you can see i've been already busy here with enhancing stuff and this one is really interesting and i'll grab a sharpen up just a little bit more in a moment uh just to make it clear i can see like a triangular formation with a square kind of in the middle you can see it right here we'll enhance it in a moment that's why you're on my channel right guys <laughs> right i mean uh, while i'm recording my it's basically like talking to yourself so <laughs> now you can see it, it's like two triangles next to each other with a square side here to the triangle uh makes sense i guess and then you got this weird kind of like box shape going around there um, I'll definitely try and enhance it, uh, over enhance it, so to say, um, just to leave out, see like the main line, so you can have a better look here. Um, uh, you gotta tell me this, this looks like some kind of, um, mechanical part of some sort for what we don't know. That's, that's actually the interesting part. You just don't know what it is, but, um, again, um, here's another interesting shape here uh let me draw it out for you you can see like a kind of broken pipe of some sort i can see it curves slightly around here i know there's a little bit um not enough pixels here but you can definitely make this out and eventually it connects to this weird intricate machine part i mean you got to be excited about this i mean uh, yeah, <laughs> there's no other way i mean unless you think that those are just rocks that's fine too uh, but like, like I always say, so many images and we constantly finding this and um, I definitely wait for these kind of pictures. These, these kind of anomalies are the ones that really get me excited. And uh, you know, I really miss curiosity. I wish that they would put out some uh, more interesting images. Um, like, like, this is really a nice picture. But when we go to the base image here, uh, it looks, um, well, as you can see pretty ridiculous and if i wouldn't enhance it for you you wouldn't just see it basically well you you, you could see it but it's so hard for the eye that uh, you you'll just miss uh, half of the important stuff here um haven't seen this before too interesting kind of again like some kind of boat like shape really drawn out here like uh, i don't know and um yeah there's uh, de definitely a lot of interesting stuff on this image. I mean, you could see the shapes there. They are simply everywhere. Um, let me see. Also, this thing, interesting. Um, I don't want to call it necessarily a face or something. <laughs> because the, you can see that there's stitching going around there. Let me zoom in some more. Um, so it's, it's tough to say. But I found it interesting. Um, I can't, you know, measure it out. So, so I could say definitely, look, it's a face or something. It's part seems to be damaged and i don't know i think it's just a rock here uh but it, it it looks interesting um there's another kind of um artificial shape around here let me just zoom in for you and um yeah you can kind of see this curve here and if you connect this it, it's it's kind of weird and then you can see another line going to the back um weird triangular kind of shape i don't know because they're sandy it's it's a little bit unclear find this interesting as well but uh, you know i made a mistake with enhancing just put into a little bit too much um, of the highlights into the image so the top area is actually brighter <coughs> and uh, i think that's it you know i think uh, that there's a lot of stuff here I'm, I'm telling you just check out my google plus page uh wait for it um you know i always did the description uh, afterwards i'll be making part two as well uh, which is the area next to this area and you gotta say this is really interesting and you wouldn't just see it in the original image let me see here let's go back see it's 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 ah come on um all these kind of stuff you you will see them in the original image but it's it's like i always say it's too hard for the eyes this is a lot easier don't you think 
Um, and that's that will be it. See you in part two, I guess. And uh, do check out this image on Google Plus. You will find a lot of stuff that I haven't pointed out here. Um, don't want to make this video too long, unfortunately. Uh, it's an interesting one as well here. See, it's kind of... It looks very interesting. Well, let me try and enhance it just a bit here. This thing here has been intriguing for too long. So yeah, I do find this interesting. Because you can see a little small 90 degree angle here. And then another kind of separation in the middle here of the rock. And then like... You know, like like three of those... Uh, no, I call them I call them ridges for the moment, and a kind of really interesting rock lying around there, and um, yeah, I mean, it's pretty cool. I mean, I, it's, it's, I wish that we had more more images like this, uh, and it's yeah, let me see, yeah. So I'll cut the video right there and uh, continue with part two. So see you in the next video. Definitely check out part two. Um, it's it's just as crazy as this one really interesting anomalies and um, I, I don't know which one is better but it's kind of this anomaly here really it really does it for me you know, that that anomaly just just did everything for me um, I haven't inverted this one yet I did I think on the other end really nice actually um, I'll post this one on Google Plus as well you can just check it out for yourself um, you can see definitely shapes pop out a lot better a lot better this see um, this kind of ridges here all stalking about three next to each other um, a lot more visible look at this thing absolutely amazing rock here or anomaly whatever it is um, you can see now how rectangular this is and um, this interesting 90 degree angle here going to the back and it's it's just so exciting this uh, official link in the description um, enhanced will be up in the description as well follow me on Google Plus and I uh, hope you enjoyed this video and see you in the next video